Hello, my name is Kirsty Armstrong. I'm a consultant nephrologist and the adult lead for young patients at the Wessex Kidney Centre, Queen Alexandra, Portsmouth. So you're probably looking at this as you are in the process of transferring from paediatric renal services to adult renal services, and you may have a number of questions. The role of my team is to make your transition from paediatrics to adults as smooth as possible. We make sure that we meet you in paediatrics from the age of 16, so that you become familiar with the team. I then see you in the adult setting, which will be attended by your paediatric consultant, and at that point you'll be handed over to the adult team. We use the Ready, Steady, Go Hello questionnaire, which helps us to identify any areas that you may need help with when you transition to adults. We would encourage you when you come to clinic to be seen on your own, although we accept that for the first couple of visits you may wish to come in with a parent or a family member or close friend. But the idea is that we help you to feel empowered with regards to managing your own condition and to give you the confidence to come to clinic on your own. So I hold monthly young persons clinics, specifically for patients aged between 18 and 25 years, at Southampton General Hospital and the Wessex Kidney Centre Queen Alexandra Hospital. These clinics are attended by our renal youth worker Gemma Hockey and you have the opportunity to meet with her after your visit with me. I am the adult renal youth worker based at the Wessex Kidney Centre, Queen Alexandra Hospital. I support young people as they're transitioning over from paediatrics to adults. My role is funded by the Kidney Care UK charity. It can be quite a challenge for young people to take on all the responsibilities of their medical care. So youth workers will talk to you one to one, maybe in a cafe in the hospital, so it's out of the medical setting completely. And we can just have a chat about what's going on for you. Sometimes it's about your next steps in life, sometimes it's about communicating with the doctors, Sometimes it's about communicating with your family, explaining all the medical terms to you. I provide emotional support about school, your home life, college, aspirations. Many young people have come to me and said to me that they'd really like to get to know other young people that come and see the adult team. My name's Nicole McKenzie. I'm a renal transplant patient and I'm under the Wessex Kidney Centre, Ports of QA Hospital. My experience transitioning peds to adults I was at first very nervous. I was expecting to sort of be left in the dark and then to come in to see a new group of people but also a new environment was pretty daunting. But I couldn't have been more wrong. I've been very much supported throughout my time here having a youth worker and from seeing the same renal consultant in childcare it's very much more between the health professionals and more so your parents and you're sort of there on the side sort of listening in but not really understanding whereas adult care you take a lot more control. I started from learning my medications of what they were, what they were for, um, how often and what the dosage was. And just learning more about my condition as well because I felt confident and comfortable with the team of people. I was more, more than happy to ask the same questions I was unsure of. One of the things that we believe makes it easier for you to transfer to adults is to have some continuity. So wherever possible, you will always see me at your clinic appointment. At your clinic visit, we will agree a plan and that will be communicated to you in a letter which will come directly to you rather than to your parents as may have been the case when you were in paediatrics. We expect you to take responsibility for your illness, to make sure you know your medications and to organise your repeat prescriptions wherever possible and to attend for blood tests and clinic appointments. My advice would be um, when moving up to the young adult clinic is to make sure you follow the Ready Steady Go programme and to get involved into social activities um, which are organised by the Wessex Kidney Centre, the Christmas meal. Um, I've also been to Marwell Zoo. I've been along to the British Transplant Games um, which were one of the things where I've made many friends from and been able to talk with people that have been in a similar situation to me. So even if you're nervous or worried about coming to your renal clinic, I strongly suggest you attend as you'll be welcomed by a friendly renal team. So I've set up a young people's working group to come along to meetings to discuss how they'd like to see the service run. I have a mobile phone so that young people can contact me. I often text young people as well because sometimes people don't want a big phone conversation. We've also set up a Facebook page. We have a young person's leaflet with all contact details from Kidney Care UK and other sources. I can also pop out to the dialysis units if you're on dialysis and need to have a chat. It can be a bit daunting 
the thought of going into an appointment without your parents or guardian. So I can come in with you just to make sure all the questions you might have are answered. We recognise this can be a very daunting time for you, transitioning at an age when there may be a lot of other things going on in your life. But we will do our very best to make this as smooth a process as possible. We look forward to welcoming you to the adults team and we will see you very soon.